Hello fans of gift and food and baking, today I'm going to share with you an early Christmas dessert. To be notified of all my new recipes, please subscribe to my YouTube channel Gift of Food and Baking. You can also get in touch with me and follow me on all my social media on Instagram and Facebook. For today's recipe of rainbow passion fruit and raspberry conserve rice pudding, I will need quarter cup of rice. To that, I will add half a cup of sugar and you can reduce the amount or increase a little bit more depending on taste. For this rice pudding, I will need two and a half cup of full fat milk and to that, I will add half a tablespoon of custard powder or you can replace with corn flour. I will also add one teaspoon of vanilla paste and you can replace with vanilla extract and I will need raspberry conserve or you can use whatever fruit you like. I will top up the rice pudding with passion fruit and mango coolie and decorate with koji berries. The first thing I will do, I will rinse the rice and let it soak in the water for at least one hour. By soaking the rice into the water, it will speed up the process of cooking the rice pudding. While the rice is soaking into the water, then I will start the next step, which is mixing the sugar with the milk and adding my teaspoon of vanilla and the half a tablespoon of cornstarch and mix it and get it ready before cooking it. Here, I'm starting to assemble my serving glasses, so I have placed in each glass a teaspoon of the raspberry conserve at the bottom of it. If you want to make your own raspberry coolie or your own raspberry conserve, you can do that. However, here I'm just speeding the process by using ready-made. I will start first by cooking the rice. So here on a medium heat, I have added the sifted rice, which is a quarter a cup, and I will boil it with one and a half cup of water. Let the rice cook completely on medium heat and cover it with a lid until it absorbs all the water and cooks. Once the rice has cooked, switch off the heat and let it cool a little bit before adding your milk mix and the reason is because the milk mix has got custard powder and it could become lumpy. Now the heat has to be very low when you add the milk and continue stirring to avoid any lumps and with a hand whisker continue whisking as well. Keep whisking until the milk heats up more and start boiling. Once it reaches the boiling stage, let it boil for an extra 5 minutes, then switch off the heat completely. The rice pudding is ready now, however, I will let it cool slightly before pouring it into my serving glasses. By the way, if you love warm rice pudding, you can eat it warm or you can leave it to cool in the fridge. Now this is nearly there, this is the final touch of topping up the rice pudding with passion fruit and mango coolie. Doesn't it look amazing already? For a Christmassy sophisticated look, I decided to decorate with koji berries and mint. However, if you don't have koji berries, you can decorate with a raspberry, just to hint that there is a raspberry layer at the bottom. Oh yes, this is the golden rainbow creamy rice pudding with passion fruit and raspberry conserve topped up with koji berries. It's so creamy, delicious, tangy and sweet. Mmm, couldn't resist it. Thank you very much for watching this video. For more Sudanese, Egyptian, African or any other international recipes, please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel Gift of Food and Baking. Until I see you with the next recipe. Bye-bye.